Okay, welcome to the Outdoorsman channel. So in a previous video I talked about changing uh, distributor cap and rotor and some ignition wires for a 2005 5 liter multi-point injection Mercruiser. And the uh, distributor cap and the rotor were relatively easy to replace, but the ignition wires probably had never been changed. I thought, what the heck, I might as well change those too. But it turned out to be uh, extremely difficult to get these off. I'll just give you a quick tip on how I got them off in case you run into this problem. I tried a variety of tools. Uh, the first is your standard uh, ignition wire tool. There's absolutely no room to get this on. If you can get it on, it just slips off. Don't bother with that one. Then I tried some uh, hose clamp pliers from Harbor Freight, which some people said were good. And theoretically, it should work and get it on there. Can't get it on though, it's impossible. Don't don't waste your money on these. They're like 15 bucks. But I got some hose clamp pliers. So they um, they didn't work either. So then I also tried this to figure what the heck I'll try everything. Uh, this tool from Liesel. It's an ignition wire tool. Can't even get it on there. Impossible. So, you know, after struggling and cursing a bit of trying to get your hands in there, there's no way to get in there. The best way I found to get it off, it's very simple. Just take a take a strap or actually a piece of rope. Get the get the coil wire exposed a little bit just wrap this around it pull it in and usually there's no room to get it on there but just get it on there as best you can just pop it off it comes right off and you don't have to buy any of this stuff so if you run into this problem try that it'll save you a lot of time um, don't waste your time with any of this stuff use a piece of rope or just a strap and you'll be good uh, if you like this video video please subscribe to the outdoorsman channel as always uh, thanks for watching and see you soon.